Hello grade 8th pupils class 8 and class 7 pupils this is a topic that uh, concerns the two classes I welcome you to our lesson today and today I want to take you through the verbs and adverbs the verbs and the adverbs they take uh, we always have verbs which is a uh, doing words in sentence or when you are writing composition to make your composition more interesting when you are using a verb there is a, an adverb that follows to make it more and more interesting if you mention a, 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 a verb in your sentence construction especially when writing composition you must or you are supposed to follow that uh, uh, verb with an adverb to make to give more information and at least to make your composition more and more interesting so listen carefully note these words know their meaning and how they are supposed to be used whenever you are writing your composition and note those adverbs note them take them seriously because they are all a very they are of a very good use to you especially when writing composition so the first proverb we have is mumbled mumbled first of all you need to know the meaning of the word mumble so that you know where to use it and how to use it in a composition so the word mumbled first of all means that it, to say something quietly making it difficult for someone to hear when you say something quietly say something quietly making it difficult for another person to hear you are mumbling especially when someone is angry some of you when you get angry you start mumbling if the teacher has, has, has punished you you go sitting down while mumbling saying some things saying some words making others quietly in an angry way making it difficult for others to hear that is what we call mumble mumbled angrily mumbled inaudibly and mumbled indistinctly so those are the adverbs that are followed by the verb mumbled we have bled bled especially maybe in an accident or you have been cut by something bled freely profusely and slightly she was bleeding profusely she bled slightly she bled freely so the word bled is followed by freely profusely and slightly as adverbs we have acted to act show some actions quickly suddenly and worriedly acted quickly suddenly and worriedly uh, we have crept crept means move slowly or and carefully to avoid being to avoid to avoid being hard or to avoid making noise so when someone is moving slowly and carefully to avoid being noticed you don't want a person or people to notice you that you are moving you move you clip crept creeping she clapped quietly silently softly so i've said clapped first of all means that moving silently or slowly to avoid being noticed by others flogged to flog somebody teachers flog pupils all the police flog people flogged mercilessly flogged cruelly flogged brutally flogged unmercifully injured 
injured accidentally fatally seriously slightly shouted frantically joyfully jubilantly loudly and suddenly bonded bonded what's the meaning of the word bonder the word bonded means think about thinking about when you think about something when you are thinking about something you are bondering bonded deeply seriously thoughtfully slept 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 fitfully lightly and soundly you slept fitfully lightly and soundly staggered to stagger means move unsteadily especially the drunkards if they have taken their alcohol they stagger along the road he staggered awkwardly they staggered drunkenly or weakly we have stuttered stuttered means talk with talk with lot or making a lot of sounds he stuttered excitedly haltingly painfully trembled to tremble you tremble especially when you are afraid of something you start trembling he trembled fearfully when he saw the lion trembled frightfully or trembled feebly sneered insolently impudently tauntingly waited he waited first of all to sneer means making a smile making a smile he sneered insolently impudently and tauntingly waited patiently anxiously smiled proudly happily or sardonically charged artfully desperately furiously walked clumsily haltingly quickly smartly whispered audibly quietly and softly so those are just a few but very very important verbs and the adverbs that they take so not that write that work and make sure you send the work for marking to confirm that you have done the work well where you feel like you don't you didn't understand well you can contact me you know you have my number so that i can also check to repeat again so make sure you do that work send it and uh, i wish you a good day be blessed